talk to yourself once in a day talk to yourself once in a day otherwise you will miss meeting an excellent person in this world this is the famous quote of swami vivekananda ji swami vivekananda ji one of the india's greatest spiritual leaders once said that education is not the amount of information that we put into your minds and run riots there undigest it all your life you must have man making life building character making and assimilation of ideas and if you have assimilated five ideas and made them your life and character then you have more education than any other man who has got by heart whole library my heart is greetings to honorable chief guest dr swami ji and all my dear friends myself sakshi and i am here to speak about one of the greatest spiritual leader of india shri swami vivekananda ji we can call swami ji the power house of energy spirituality resolve power self confidence and energy of thoughts not only india but the whole world gets energy from him he sowed the seeds of self eminent self confidence self respect and the independence in the minds of people of india he taught the people of india to love their nation his pre monastic name was narendranath datta and was born on 12th of january 1863 in calcutta his father vishwanath datta was an attorney in calcutta high court he was from a highly educated family and was a gifted child with high thinking and intelligent mind and strong will power his mother bhuvneshwari devi was a devout housewife his mother played an important role in shaping his thinking and personality from a very early age he used to meditate for longer times greatest achievement of swami ji's life was that he made the world realize to the power of india swami ji was a genius man who had full knowledge of vedas his precious knowledge proved him to be the greatest man in the history of india when we are talking about swami ji's life and we don't even mention about his guru shri ram krishna paramhans ji then it's not done shri ram krishna paramhans ji was an unmatched guru and swami vivekanand was a wonderful disciple her her guru used to win hearts guru was to live in hearts and his disciples his devotees vivekananda used to have wisdom this pair was a un, uh, unique match and it makes this pair so so special in the era when swami ji what uh, was at his life peak india was a slave of britishers at the time he addressed the young generation of india by saying that arise awake and stop not until the goal is reached in the year 1893 when the world's first parliament of religions was held in chicago at the time swami ji gave a wonderful speech starting with the words as brothers and sisters of america which surprised the whole world and you would love to know that 7000 people listening to his words at the time stood up and played applause for him about 2 minutes and also complimented him in 1893 swami ji proved india's new form the shining form of india he was a victorious personality he was such a great personality that even today when, when i am talking about him my words are falling short he devoted his whole life for people lived his life throughout for people and encouraged people with positive energy and at last he said goodbye to the world at a very early age of 39 on 4th of july 1902 but the great man never died his thought always remain alive he is an inspiration for the youth of today he is the present idol for in us and example to this is that today in india his birthday is celebrated as the national youth day and at last i would like to salute 
Swami Vivekanand ji and his thoughts. May his thoughts always remain immortal even after our next 100 generations. Thank you for listening me so patiently. Jai Hind, Jai Bharat.